plaintiff, Richard Bailey, says when he started dating the defendant, he felt like the luckiest man in the world. But his luck soon ran out. Richard claims the defendant was abusive, and she constantly accused him of cheating. And he's suing her because she ran her car into his car. Defendant Catherine May admits that she didn't trust Richard, but that's because he ended up cheating on her with his witness. Catherine denies owing Richard for anything. Start with you. Well, this uh, stems from our relationship of past. What uh, years were you all or months were you all in a relationship? 14 hard months. 14 hard <laughs> months of labor. <laughs> hard labor. It's like 14. hard labor. Yeah, right. Yes. Uh, Catherine, our relationship started off beautiful. I cannot ask for a better person. I thought that's what I get when you're lucky. I found out my luck ran out. She became truly abusive. How did she change? Well, <laughs> the scratch and sniff test was one. You used to come in late or what have you? When I come in, yes, sir, mm -hmm. absolutely. I have the sniff test mm -hmm. and be scratched up trying to defend home front. Yeah, okay. scratch and sniff test, yeah. Did you pass regularly? <laughs> Only she. To get you that answer, because I started me. trying to. Only she, what did she say? Did she say oh, that? Oh, no, assume the position. I know, but when she finished. When she said something. Did she say she, you did something? Nine times out of ten, I always did something. Okay, that's yeah. what I'm asking well, you. absolutely. She if, would if you usually did conclude that you had done something. Yeah, you might have cleaned up a little bit. Uh, you, you know, okay, say you smell can, like soap. Yeah, too too much like soap. Okay, too much all like right. Soap. Or you didn't walk perfume. far enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't walk far enough. Oh, you didn't do what? You didn't walk far enough. You, 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 you smell still fresh. You know, oh. You should have <laughs> <should've laughs> traveled a little farther around. <laughs> Took the long route. How often did you have to go through this? Roughly, that, that lasted periodically almost the entire relationship. Um, and you did it. <laughs> All right, let me hear from you. Well, it was a reason for that. Look, so at the same time... Well, you should have just left. If that was something that you were so determined to do and it caused strife in the relationship and you couldn't get past doing that... He kept coming back. He kept coming back I to know. me. That's so... why I'm telling me he's a fool. How did she change? The scratch and sniff test was one. You used to come in late or what have you? Absolutely, I have the sniff test mm -hmm. and be scratched up trying to defend home front. It was a reason for that. Look. Defendant Catherine May dated the plaintiff, but she claims he cheated on her with his witness. Let's get to how she was involved in that. What mm -hmm. prompted you to do that based on her? Because she done been to my house before with her boyfriend, so it's supposed to have been, but she was supposed to have been married. Okay, but how did you determine that coming there to see him with her boyfriend meant he was messing with her? They together. They together now? Yeah, they're together now. But I figured they was uh, already seeing okay. each other. And what happened to this guy she was coming over there with? It was supposed to have been one of his friends. I don't, I don't know all his friends, so he just introduced me to him, and I just keep it moving, but uh, never yeah. seen him again. Yeah. That's how I knew it was all about her. I don't know whether him. to believe. Ma'am, I know he's a fool, but he ain't that big a fool. Yes, he really is. Crazy. Yes, he is. He so always bring his did. woman over to your house while you there and play it off like she yes, with the other yes, guy. Yes, I don't yes. believe that. I'm at work, and Sir, he bring people you're in. you're a fool, but you ain't that big of a fool. Not, not, that, not, not, not that big of a fool. You're a fool for letting us sniff up and, and down, you number it one. Might be somebody good good and crazy. Somebody might be good Turn around. and crazy. <laughs> Lift up your arms. Yeah. Go your ahead, honor, sir. Please, I just can't honor, get past that. Honor, I know don't that Don't traumatize happens. me, Your Honor, because I like to assume the position then. Go ahead, uh, but sir. She good, Tell she me good about this uh, uh, visit with oh, your current yes. woman and that so-called boyfriend of hers. See, that's... This is a personal friend of mine. Mm -hmm. Her friend at the time is a close friend of mine, mm -hmm. a male friend of mine. Just my interaction with anybody of the opposite sex caused these thoughts, these type of actions. And that's one of the reasons that separated us to this date. You all don't date? I mean, yes. 
we were on a date when the, the date in question of this incident here, I would consider it a date. But it was generally just lunch. And I was venting. A date is when you're interested romantically, sir. Well, okay, then we're And that being like the that. case, she might have been on to something if you brought that woman over to your house in front of her with your good buddy, and the next thing you know, y'all going on a date. And Thank all you. truth. Thank you. It sounds like Thank that. Thank you. But yeah. yeah. One of you got sniffed on. You better start doing some. <laughs> That's right. You. You better start doing some sniffing, because there ain't no telling what he doing. I'm you don't sniff? Oh, she gonna oh. get it, How too. you find uh, out? It goes around in a circle. Your Honor, I don't know what Come on, stand up. What you do to catch him? Your Honor... You don't have a process? No, sniffing I don't need a process. Sniffing work for her? I don't need that. Go ahead. I'm good. Um, number one, she's kind of off, because... We went out that one time mm -hmm. when she came out like a banshee. On a date. I didn't like she's, any parts like he of that said, on a date. Anymore. And like he yeah, said, on a date. Well, that was way after Judge Mathis. How long that after? was like Just maybe. How long after? Yeah, been this over there, oh, though. Quiet. Yeah, sweetie. How long I'm after? I'm talking to Judge. How long after? Maybe a year. And I wasn't it, dating him. He the didn't man say a year? With. How long was no, it? No, no, no. How the long incident was? before, sir, how long before after breaking up with her did you begin dating your witness? One time. One time. How long after dating much. her did that one too time much. occur? That was too much, but when because she, she said her, house one was a year, year, you say two but months. I you that was a year for him. Get to what you're suing there about. We see what time it is, sir. Yeah. That's why you're getting sniffed on. Go ahead. That part. What's you suing I'm, for? Tell I'm me about for the, the damage car damages. Tell me about the car damages. The car damage is three thousand two hundred and eighty-five dollars worth of damage. What happened? On the day in question, what I would say, our date. Tell me we, the date, approximately. March the 6th. Uh -huh. March the 6th, 2019. We when you out, all on your date. We were on mm -hmm. our date. We was at a, a downtown restaurant. Got it. Mm -hmm. An outdoor out restaurant. We sat there. We talked. We had lunch. I left from our lunch. We were sitting in the car. Catherine comes in her truck and is driving straight toward the car. I mean, her sitting in the car. She made a notion, is that your lady? I said, I hope that's ain't the part of my language. But to any rate, I tried to move the car out the way because she steady right it, right it, right it. I'm asking, like, what you got going on? Me and you through. You need to go head on at your business. As I go and park back in, she comes, backs it on up, gave it right to me, smashed the car in question. Now she has the, now she has this ooh, blank ooh. stare in her I face. I know this woman didn't do this, sir. As you preach, Lies, lies somebody tell. As you preach, she tried to take the little fella in. She tried to take me in. Both of y'all. Well, at least you're, at least you're being real. Now she's being real. When she smashed this automobile, she has this blank stare. I get out the car. I'm asking what the hell is wrong with yeah. you. Now she don't want to go to jail. What happened to her car when she smashed it? She smashed it with her back of her darn truck. She, uh, she okay. went on Not out her business. Not much damage. Okay. <laughs> It costs 3000 in repairs? Absolutely. Okay. And when you've asked for your money, what has she said? She gave me $200 at the scene because she didn't want to go to jail. Nobody don't want... Okay. Let me hear from you, ma'am. I gave him $200. No, tell me what happened first. Oh, yeah. Um, I was upset because the simple fact is he always playing games with me. I what feel type like of games? He, he lies a lot. He'll take my car. And he'll go, uh, go. He'd be gone okay. for like two or three days. People like this, he'll be all in my car, you know. And I'm just really fed up with it. Defendant Catherine May dated the plaintiff, but she claims he cheated on her with his witness. Were you all broken up March 6th? Mm hmm. Yes, we were. So why did you do it? You all were broke up. Because he would come and play games with me. What like kind of he, games? You were yeah, broke Paul, up. Yeah. It broke up to broke up to him is mean we separated, but he'll call me and be like, okay, well, uh, can I come over and blase squad? But you still broke up. But we still broke up. So why is he playing games? He just he come on. He, he want to come, come over. If he coming over, if he's coming over. No, no. If me. you are allowing him to yeah, come over, let's I'm allowing start him there. To come over, yeah. Ain't nobody we, trying to go back. Quiet, sir. Yeah, I'm allowing him to come over. Right. So, so how is he playing games? Because he's lying to me. He's lying to you about me, what? Telling me that we can be together. He's okay. telling me we can be together. How many times has he done that? Too many. You've Five allowed that two. too many times. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because so you're playing games too. No, you I'm know not. that's what the man is gonna do because well, he's done it 
before. Too many times. So you keep letting him do it. You're playing games. Then on March 6th, towed up this man's car because <laughs> you was mad. You weren't even going with the man. He had his woman there, his new woman. Judgment for the plaintiff. You admit to totaling his car because you were mad after he broke up and you saw him with another woman. You should have just stuck to sniffing. Have a good day. <laughs> Judgment for the plaintiff. better than me, that's for sure. Huh. So, Sweetie, uh, you know you can I, get it whenever I, I, you're ready. I'm all right with it. But I I'm know. a lady. So keep with it. Yeah, I hope y'all have a, a great time together, because it won't last long. You'll be some, you'll be next. You'll Sweetie, be. I'm nothing like you, so you, mind your business. Touch your nose. Yeah. Keep doing close, what you do. Keep sniffing. your mouth closed. You bloodhound. I am so happy. Keep sniffing. Keep your mouth closed, baby. You're gonna start keep you sniffing after a while. No, I don't do that, because I'm a lady. Come on. Let's go.